What's up everyone, it's Fleet here, and today we're going to be starting a brand new series, and I'm going to call it Building a Discord Server. So, I've had people ask me in my Discord server to make a server for my YouTube, and so I've decided to make one. Now, as I know a lot of you struggle with making Discord servers, I'm going to be making videos step by step on how I build my server, to show you guys all the important information, and to make it easier as you can find all the information in just one place. So for today's video, we're going to be looking at how you can make an assigned roles channel using YAGPDB. This is quite popular now in Discord servers, and so I know a lot of people struggle with it, and I thought I would start with it first. Make sure you like the video if you want more videos like this, and I'll be making the server public once all the videos have been created in the series. So keep an eye out for that. Also make sure to look out for the animal somewhere in the video, and the first person to comment it gets a shout out. Okay, let's begin. So firstly, I'm going to add the bot to the server and I'll leave a link down below for the bot's invite so you guys can easily find it. Okay, so the bot's now in the Discord server. Now obviously the first thing you're going to want to do is make some roles for your server. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. You can name the roles anything you want, but there's no need to go through permissions for this part. So once you've made all the roles you're going to use, you want to head over to YAGPDB's website and make sure you sign in with your Discord account. I'll be leaving a link to the website in the description below, as well as an invite to my community server, which is super close to 500 members, so make sure to go and check that out. Okay, so once you've signed into the website, you want to select the server which you're going to edit. So in this case, it's Fleet's Fantasy. Also, make sure that if you're doing this, you must be an owner of the server, otherwise the server won't show up. So select the server you want to use, and then it should come up with some kind of control panel. Now, you want to scroll down until you find the MISC section, and then you want to click role commands. So the first thing you're going to want to do is make a group. So in this case, it's going to be upload. Then you want to choose what mode you want. So single being only one reactable role for each group and then multiple being however many you want in that specific section. So in this case, I'm going to click single. Then when you're ready, create a group. Then you go to role command and you type your role name. So in this case, notification squad. And then you want to pick which group it is, so upload, and then choose the role, so notification squad. And then you want to create the new role command when you're ready. So now you can see the notification squad is in the group settings for upload. So now if you flick back to Discord, now you want to go to the channel that you want the reactant role to be in. So ping roles in this case. So then you want to type in the command hyphen role menu space create and then the name of the group so in this case upload now you should see this message show up and then all you need to do is react with what emote you want for the reactant so there you have it the role works and you can see it's given me the role notification squad so now all you need to do is just remove the messages which you're not going to use so this one and this one and there you go so there you have it you've just created your own reactant role so that's all for today's video. I know it's a short video, but I wanted to make this as simple as possible. But drop a like and also subscribe because it's free and you don't want to miss the uploads I have planned for next week. The shout out on this video goes to Politic Grim. They post some short videos which seem kind of cool, so be sure to drop them a sub. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!